Halloween just seems more popular every year, and the jack-o'-lantern remains its most popular symbol. The way I see it, if one jack-o'-lantern will keep away the evil spirits, three ought to really do the trick, and especially if you combine them to build a jack-o'-lantern totem pole. This is a fun twist on old Jack. Let me show you how to put it together. The first thing you'll want to do is find three pumpkins that you can easily stack one on top of the other. A large one at the bottom, a medium-sized one in the middle, and one to round off the top. Now, the idea here is to cut a shaft all the way up through the three pumpkins so a light can shine through them. The smallest pumpkin will determine the size of the holes I cut. I'm going to cut these about four to five inches in diameter and I'll go ahead and clean out the seeds. I found an ice cream scoop and an old jar lid very helpful when trying to scrape all of this goo out. Now for the fun part, giving these guys a little personality. I like to give each one a unique face. One menacing, one happy, and one a little surprised. With the carving done, I'll stack the totem and secure one jack-o'-lantern to the next by pinning them with these wooden floral stakes. When it comes to lighting this up, you can use a flashlight, but recently I came across a focus lamp. They're inexpensive, run on batteries, and will last a long time. With so many different varieties of pumpkins out there, and so many different faces you can carve, the sky's the limit. The main thing is just be creative and have fun. From the garden, I'm Alan Smith.